see this is Praxis, and you can clearly see my roof is leaking on account of it not being there. <laughs> it's kind of raining inside the house right now. Just had a curtain of rain come through. It lasted for a while. Uh, Josh was helping me here this morning. He was doing more board moving. My goal is to get all the lumber that's out there, all the building supplies that you can kind of see uh, just still sitting out there. I want to get all that up and moved and on the north side of the house. And um, the reason I want to do that is because uh, the site work people are kind of working around it. That slows them down. Plus, I need to do site work underneath where that lumber is. So we're preparing an area over there. And he's kind of bringing some stuff that needs to go up top, up against the house. And we're pulling that up. And the rest of the stuff is going all, all around over there. So that's going to keep things moving over there. And, uh, you know, getting lumber sorted as it comes up over here, which is helpful for me. Because a lot of the stuff that I need for the roof is at the bottom of some of those stacks. So he was helping me with that until the rain came in and, uh, you know, I was just straight with him. It's like, you know, dude, if you want to keep working, that's fine. But if, you know, you don't want to be working in this cold rain, that's fine too. Uh, from my perspective, uh, you know, there's no reason for me to, like, be a hard ass. Like, you know, you need to keep going, we need to keep going. Because, uh, you know, it costs me the same amount of money to hire him for an hour working in the rain versus an hour working in pleasant conditions. And, you know, I know that you're not going to get as much done when you're slipping around on mud and all that kind of stuff. So, from my perspective, you know, why pay him the same amount to get less work done if, you know, you're trying to, like, work in the rain. So, so I was cool with him splitting. In fact, I was going to leave, too. Uh, I just was kind of covering up the piles that, you know, after he, he left, trying to keep things as dry as I could. Uh, and uh, the rain's kind of tapering off a little now. So, I don't know, I might stick around. I... I was working on floorboards. I can't really do much more with floorboards now because, you know, they got wet again. And, you know, I say all the time, you know, they, they don't fit together very well when they're all wet and swollen. So I don't know if I'm going to do that. But there are other things I can do. I can bring more of this lumber up. I've got some people coming tomorrow. Uh, they're kind of friends from my old life when I was a cinematographer. And they do have some construction experience. They wanted to see what I was doing. They're going to be on site tomorrow. And I think I'll just try to have things kind of prepped for them. I was kind of hoping we'd be doing uh, roof uh, trusses together with them, although the, given the fact that I can't really finish the floors today, which I otherwise would have been able to if we hadn't had the rain come through. I don't know about that. The forecast had been that we were going to get rain like maybe later in the day. Tonight it came by early. It's like not even noon yet. So I don't know. But there's still more for me to do. There's jobs you can do when it's sunny and jobs you can do when it's not sunny. And I'll just do the not sunny, not, not dry jobs right now, which is usually just moving a lot of lumber and sorting it. That's it. Thanks for watching.